Hi guys, how are you guys doing today? Um, I know you're like, whoa, another video. I thought you quit YouTube. Yeah, I did. I don't post as much videos as I do, but um, I decided to make this video because I thought it was kind of fun. I should update you the concerts I went to. But before I do that, I want to take a moment of silence out. I know it hasn't happened yet, but I want to pray. I know. Um, religion doesn't matter to me. I just want to pray for the. My, I, I, I know we each one of us probably have a friend, a family, a relative that lives in Florida, probably going to be impacted by Hurricane Matthew, and then Nicole. Those are bitches, Tay. That's those people are bitches. No, it's hurricanes are bitches. But you know, um, I have my uncle Bob. I have my Peggy Desmond. Um, a friend of mine from like Party Light. And YouTube, yeah, Party Light. Um, and I have, um, I used to stop Party Light back in the day. Um, I have my my friend Ryan and his husband Ryan, Jim Clay. Um, those are four people that I know personally that are probably going to be affected by the storm. And I just want to pray for them for their safety and everything. I hope you guys are be doing okay. Please update me, yo. I try to call yo. Well, I try to call Dad, Uncle Bob, but um, see if you heard anything from you because before, I, after I saw you posted, and Coke does about it good. But um, I just want to be posted. You know, I, just, I, everybody's saying they're gonna be okay, but you never know. I think goodness, goodness vibes and positive vibes come out of this. That everybody listens and stuff to stop being a dumbass and stay. Oh, I'm gonna ride out the storm. Okay. I, Alcar, no, I'm not the ganja strange, a drag queen, famous drag queen, no. People usually ride it out in Florida, it's like, oh, this is, no, this one is like Hugo, okay, whatever. But I hope you guys, whoever has it in my audience has family and friends, I hope they're safe too. I love y'all. And let's get on with this video, please. Okay. I didn't want to post about this, but I kind of did, as I've been thinking about it. Uh, last month, I finally went to two concerts after 2012, so four years I've been to, since I've been to a concert. No, 2013. 12 and 13, I think. No, yep, 2012. So I went to April, and I went to one in December. Four years, I went to two concerts over the weekend, one weekend in September. September 17th, I went to see Era, August Burns Red, Make Him Suffer, Silent Planet. I won tickets from him from Delilah Presents. It's a local, it's a promotion company around here that promoted Slayer. But anyways, um, I, like I said, I won tickets to him, so I'm like, you know what, I'll go. I'll take a friend, but friend couldn't go. So this is my first concert. Ever since being ever in the old National Center, which is all these different rooms for shows. Deluxe was a small ass room, okay? Um, be compared to, for me seeing um, Chris Cornell. But, anyways, it was an awesome show. Um, I was, you know, it was really good. It's, it's hardcore style, you know? I was like, if you're into that stuff like I am too. It's hardcore, so I'm in the front because I got a fast pass, which I was able to get in early. Got front row center. I'm like, okay. Then all of a sudden, <clears throat> it started. Get, excuse me, it started getting good. Make him suffer is one of my favorite. One of my good. I bands I listen to quite often. Not my say my favorites, but they're they're really really good. I was jamming out on the bassist about like this here and gave me a freaking. High five me and gave me a freaking. Uh, I know my hair's a mess. Gave me a freaking guitar pick, which was cool. So other than that, I had a good time there. Wah, wah, wah. That's all I heard was wah, 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 on the way home. It sucked. I had to walk home. No one wanted to give me a ride because my sis, my brother, my not my brother, but my husband had company over and I just didn't want to deal with them. Bitch, 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 bitch. That's all they do. But not my bro my brother and her sister. But um. The two people. And when I got home, that's all they were doing. Bitch, 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 bitch. Whatever. 
So I'm like, okay, so I had, because I had Saturday off. I had Tuesday off for Slayer, Slayer, September 20th. Got there about, I got there a little earlier for the show because I had to go to, I had to go to um, Will Call to pick up my ticket. So I had to be there by five o'clock to pick up my tickets but for August Burn Red. I didn't stay for August Burn Red. I went home. I went to see Slayer, Anthrax, and Death Angel show. That was a fucking awesome show. I got there, met some people, you know, talked to people and stuff. Um, got front row, got smushed like this. I'm sitting there going like this. Rocking out and stuff. Got a pick from Scott Ian, personally. Same thing happened with the basses from Make Him Suffer. Hand me one. Highlight of my night was Joey Baladona had a making fun of a crowd surfer going he stinks and stuff and then gave me a monster because I was thirsty because I couldn't move I was like literally I was sitting like this and there's uh I, if you guys follow me on Facebook I had live show on it I had a photographer actually it was a really cool picture of me just going like this staring at him I'm trying to figure out who it was and all that and and then the background in the back was like all faders just like I mean, so it was really cool. Then uh, Death Angel was on first. They were an old 80s thrash band. The guy couldn't sing like shit. He couldn't sing, but the band was good. Then came up Anthrax. That was fun. I love that show. Joey Belladonna saw the original lineup besides Mike Spitz. I think one of them is not the original members. No, he's not the original. I think the guitarist is not original, but who cares? It was a good show. I was mad that they couldn't play Bring the Noise, dun, 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 dun. and I'm the man, I'm the law. Anthrax is one of my favorite bands ever. Then came on Slayer. Like I said, I haven't seen Slayer in years, so I wouldn't, didn't know how to expect the crowd to be in Indy and all that. And they were okay. There's like, not what I want to expect it. I mean, at Slayer show, yo, I want some head walking, I want some crowd surfing, I want some pits, I want some circle pits. I want this. It was like pushing. It was mashing, but not as quite, not as quite as crowd surfers. It was just like, what the fuck? You know, there's more action at my other show than this. It's like, damn. But I was smushed. And then all of a sudden, this stupid motherfucker, excuse my language, came in. Right right at the end of the song, last song was De uh, Angel of Death. Came in trying to go like this. I'm like trying to move. I'm like, boom, and hit him. And I'm like, dude, you don't fucking do that. Trying to get up in this bitch. You trying to get rid of me, huh? Yeah, I did, bitch. Because I hit you with uh, two. A friend of mine, is, she's kind of big girl. She got her booby smushed and told her she's going to get a boob job because of it and shit. But I'm just like, you don't do that. That's etiquette. Sorry, I still have a cold and a cough. You know, leave in the comments below if you guys ever had that happen before. Like going to your favorite show. You've been there all day. You know, plus I had to work the night before and I'm like, oh. I'm all tired and shit because I had to stay till 10 o'clock that morning. I remember this now. 10 o'clock that morning. Then Daryl got mad at me because I had a good time. But anyways. Well, because he went to a concert by himself. Who cares? Who cares? It's over and done with. I'm going to bring up the past. Positive vibes. Positive energy. That's all we need to be getting through this stuff. So the concert was good. I walked home. Kind of sucked though because uh, I didn't want to break my glasses. So I was like... Blind is a bad time to look. I'm like, I made it look like I was in the middle of the damn road looking for the street signs where the hell I'm going. But I made it home. Um, sweaty, thirsty, hungry. But, um, but anyways, I just had a good day today. Just like pray for Florida. I know it's like pray for Mexico, but pray for Florida. If you have any friends and family or you live there too in my audience, I hope you guys are safe. I love y'all. Please have a great day today. I hope everything is positive and getting positive energy for you. Um, tomorrow I got to go to work early in the morning to do reports and go home and come back to 10 to 5. So I'm like exhausted right now. And I'm probably going to go back to bed. So I'll see you guys. On that note, I'll see you guys when I see you. Later. Love y'all. Peace.